right, coming up on 1030, how about we serve up some celebrity dish? Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Hi, guys. With the media prince. The media yes. prince is in, in the food. building. Yes, all right. And um, can we just say... Wow. <clears throat> he's nominated Man. yet again for Ooh. the Mayor's Arts Award. Congratulations. Well deserved. Thank you. Tell us all about this big nomination. Ooh. Goodness. I am excited. Um, hopefully, I take the win this year. This is my second time being nominated. Sure. Okay. And it just, honestly, it's just an achievement for this area. It just really means that people really believe in your craft. And it's the mayor's awards. For sure. Crying yeah. Out loud. sure. It's yeah. Like, how great is that? I Man. think it's your year. And two nominations does not make you Susan Lucci. I mean, you're, you, 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 I think, I think you, you're not going to have to wait as long as her, for I, sure. I love that you guys yeah. hear this, right? We're speaking she it into speaking existence. It into well, existence. That's, well, if that blazer has anything to do with it, I mean, I, I, I would vote for you right today, See, media I'm Prince. voting for the hat. Oh, my right? goodness gracious. I mean, come on. We, we, we didn't even this get to the chains and the rings and the watches. I know. Yeah. We're here. <laughs> All right, you ready to serve up some dish? Let's do it. We're going to start with this. Fans were stunned to learn that Joe Jonas is divorcing wife Sophie Turner. Now Jeez. we might be getting some insight into what actually went wrong. Producer Chris standing by with the latest <laughs> twist in this celebrity divorce saga. Chris? And I will just say the irony of what I'm about to report is not lost on me. According to TMZ, <laughs> Joe Jonas allegedly caught Sophie Turner on their ring security camera doing or saying something that led to to this divorce filing. It is not clear what Sophie Turner allegedly said or did. However, the incident was the, quote, final straw for Joe Jonas, according to TMZ. Again, whatever occurred made the pop singer realize his marriage to the 27-year-old British actress was over. In a joint statement posted to Sophie's Instagram account, the couple called the split a united decision, and here's the part, asked that everyone respect their wishes for privacy, which mm. seems ironic considering the nature of how whatever was sure. said or done was discovered. So what Man, do you think it was? A possible invasion of privacy. I don't know. Who knows? What do you guys think? I, I just... I. Don't tell us to respect privacy, but tell us that you guys are divorcing. <laughs> We're in an age where everyone else is just showing us stuff. Let us see the ring. For I know, what do you think she did? What do you think she did? That's the juicy stuff. Because the ju the, it seems like they're trying to protect what she did. They're saying that she's saying or doing yeah. something, but yeah. I think he caught uh, a Mr. Tuesday oh, coming in oh, on goodness, the ring cam. Gracious. And you mm. would think she would be a little bit more responsible in that aspect since... Mm -hmm. Ring cameras are like the it thing right now. What do you think? I'm gonna say this, Media Prince. Uh, the, the thing about ring cameras, they're terrific because they keep you safe. We all wanna feel safe and secure, right? The thing about ring cameras is that they record everything. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes, you might not really, really feel a certain way about your loved one, but you might be on the telephone and you might that's be what expressing. I think. Uh, yes, that's you what might I think. Be expressing you think that I don't think it was as blatant as someone that's walking right. in. I think that's it was That's right. Yes. Oh my Ooh. gosh, I can't stand Joe. Did you you yeah, believe yeah, that you won't right. believe what Joe did last night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you say that. She could have been talking to Mr. Tuesday, who wasn't there, sure. and she said, I love you, Mr. Tuesday. There we go. Yeah, it could or be he that. Might, he might have found out where that extra two million went in oh, her secret this, account. Oh. Man, this See, is, this is why so, he's nominated. I know, right? <laughs> but here's the thing. There was a reason why he was going through the ring camera. Yeah, well, that's oh. true. Maybe he was just well, expecting see, delivery. Holly, I don't now know. you just but, I mean, went I'm a just, layer I, yeah. deeper than without. I mean, we're writing Chris. the script here, Chris. Sure. That's yes, we right. are. We have Man. to. That's right. There yeah. are so many possibilities. <laughs> and I have a safe bet that TMZ is going to have a lot more on this story. In the meantime, we're getting a full first look at Kim Kardashian now flexing her acting chops, okay? She's going to be in the next installment of American Horror Story. We've talked about that before. The trailer for season 12 of the show dropped yesterday. In it, Kardashian plays a character named Siobhan Walsh who's seemingly a friend of Emma Roberts' character named Anna Alcott. Take a look. Focus on the good. All this will be worth it once we meet our perfect baby. I want that too. What a pretty that woman, I think she's following me. You're on a ton of meds. You got a lot on your mind. You have a peculiar penchant for turning dreams into nightmares. You 
just rest up, my dear? All right, so American Horror Story co-creator Ryan Murphy announced Kart Kardashian's participation. That happened back in the spring. The reality star says she took acting lessons to prepare for the project. Season 12 of American Horror Story airs Wednesdays starting September 20th. So the question is, based on that brief clip, did those acting lessons pay off? <laughs> It's ironic it's called American Horror Story because oh, Kim's man. acting is a horror. Good. Um, <laughs> let's just say hopefully the trailer doesn't show that, you know, because from, okay. from the trailer it's looking like, uh, but we'll see. It's Kim Kardashian, why not? Media Prince, we're, we're going to go in opposite directions for the uh -oh. second time. Here. Now, <laughs> listen, Kim Kardashian catches a lot of flat producer Chris, mm -hmm. and it's for good reasons. And not everything that she does is in the greatest way. We talked about privacy a moment ago. She doesn't really uh, believe in that, but... Mm -hmm. Let's give Kim Kardashian her flowers for everything that she does do. Yes. From building an empire to helping out with criminal justice, now she's getting into acting as well. Kim Card, K Kim K, I'm clapping for you today. Well, well hopefully see, it's I, better. I, I agree. I, like, I agree with movie. both of you. Oh, with Holly. both of you, because okay. here's, I think okay. she is doing. Okay. She's yes. doing a lot of great things that she's been yes. really good at, and it has earned her this right to get a spot on American Horror Story. But I think if we're using the word acting, sure. we're not really following the definition of acting yeah. because I just saw her playing Kim K. Right. You see right, what I'm right. saying? <laughs> right. Like, right. Right. Strengths. That's what they say, right? I think they have her in the show because they just want people to watch because Kim K is going to be on it. Well, that's the absolute reason. Right? Yeah. Well, if but she's I'm... upgraded from the Tyler Perry movie, then we'll just have to see. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Let's talk about Drake now, okay? Because he is showing off some of the spoils of living the high life. All right? We've talked before about how fans throw bras at him, and he apparently saves those receipts. He posted this picture on his Instagram page yesterday showing off I mean, I imagine this is just some of the bras that have landed on stage during his current tour. And let's be honest, there are worse things people could throw at you while you're on stage, right, guys? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> he said, right, guys, don't say gal. Wow. Media yeah. press. You know what's crazy? Every time I get here, we talk about Drake sure. with bras. And I said this may be his new calling. He may need to just go ahead and start a bra line. Yeah. He seems to know Ooh. the measurements correctly. Right. He clearly seems right, to yeah. collect them. Yeah. And wow. yeah. he's, if you look at it, he's great with color, co color coordinating them yeah, as well. He, so he might be on to something. Uh, Media Prince, uh, for once, we're going to agree on this one. Oh, Listen, I I, felt I, it. Aubrey, Aubrey, a lot of, uh, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> me, Aubrey, Steph Curry, we're all uh, bringing it all back, if you know what I'm talking about here. <laughs> <laughs> this bra collection is a phenomenal collection. If you're into that type of thing, Aubrey, he's got all of the colors lined up there. He's got them in a fashionable way. He should take a picture of that and frame it. Okay, I really think sure. there should be a lingerie showdown between Drake and his bras yes. and Tom Jones and his wow. underwear, <laughs> like the OG <laughs> original exactly. that encouraged ladies yeah. to take it off and cast <laughs> instead. stay. Wow. I'm just saying. Why not? That's a pretty good idea, right? <laughs> all right, let's wrap things up with yeah. Tom Brady, okay, because he's got a new gig. He's retired from football, and now apparently he's working for Delta Airlines, <laughs> but he's not a pilot. He's not a flight attendant. The company announced that they've hired the retired quarterback as their new company-wide strategic advisor. In that role, Brady will help build teamwork tools for the airline's employees. And according mm. to the airline, we'll talk to Delta staff about, quote, greatness, resilience, excellence, and performance in a team sport. No word yet on how much Brady is expected to get paid, but if I'm a Delta Airlines employee, I would probably ask for a raise because yeah. they must have some money if they're paying Tom Brady no. to join the roster. What do you think? I think it's actually a really pretty good idea. Sure. He's, he's clearly someone that has, of course, we've seen all the rings, all the things. Exactly. that he's come, Clearly, there's a strategy there with how he works within a team and gets them to their goal. Yes. I think he'll be able to instill those skills into Delta. Yeah. And, you know. Tom Brady. Six-time Super Bowl champion, uh, arguably the greatest quarterback of all time. And yes. you take a look at him. It wasn't necessarily how great of a talent that he was. It was his leadership. Mm -hmm. It was the way that he got along with his teammates, etc. And when he walks into that building, I saw Magic Johnson walk into commander's practice mm -hmm. yesterday. Everybody stood up at attention at that point. When Tom Brady starts talking, Delta will listen. Well, hey. if Tom Brady's going to be with Delta, I'm yeah. going to apply now. Can you give me an application, <laughs> Chris? That's my, my Maybe regrets. there'll be some Tom Brady specials on the plane now. There you hey, go. See, I'm Delta. I love to fly them. All right, Media Prince, good to see you. Thank it's you. Good to Thank see you, you guys for coming as well. in. Oh, yeah. Let us know when you win that award. Yes. And bring from, it in. From your mouth. All right. To you guys.